back to the YouTube channel. It's your boy, Mr. Goob. And today is a very special vlog. I'm not going to lie to you. It is my very first ever Teddy Afro concert experience. And for those that don't know who Teddy Afro is, he's basically the Michael Jackson of the Habesha community. And the Habesha community, if you don't know still, is the Ethiopian Air Chain communities. Come on, basically. And for my hop shop people, this is about to be a banger because y'all know how, how fine Teddy Afro is. I'm about to go link up with my boy Muse. Y'all know him from the previous videos. Few moments later. And we're here with the special guest, Muse. Mr. Steve. <laughs> well, we about to go embark on our first Teddy Afro journey. I'm not gonna lie, we better go first see concert, the concert. Dude. Uh, you know, concert, yeah. yeah, for sure. I mean, the next time I see y'all, we gonna be in the line, probably headed into, maybe we might, we might be in in the concert by then. We might but be a I, part hey, of the concert. All I know. Always like, look, y'all gonna see y'all. Ain't gonna be on game tonight. Yeah, I'm gonna be on. I'm gonna be on game.
next day. Welcome back. I hope you guys enjoyed all the footage from the concert and everything else. Uh, so I did end up getting a picture with Teddy Afro that night. And I want to just tell you guys the story time because it was kind of funny. At the end of the show... Like everybody had already cleared out and like there was like security that was like guarding his section. And I like went up to security guard and I was like, yo, like, could I go, could I go get a picture? Like, come on, like, fuck with me, please. And then he was like, no, you got $400? And I was like, no, I don't have $400. And then he was like, all right, get the heck out of here, whatever. But he didn't use that terminology, but you know. So like, I was like, I gotta find a way to get a picture with him. I like went back to like kind of where that area was where everybody was like partying and stuff. And like, I like everybody, the, the band was like cleaning up their like materials and stuff, whatever instruments and stuff. And I could see that like all the staff members had like a, like a thing around their neck, like a, like a, like just a thing around the neck that said like staff or whatever. And so I, so what I did, I like improvised. I put this around my neck and uh, it's my key, it's my keychain. I put this around my neck and I hopped on the stage and I like put my hat on and I was like acting like I started picking up stuff, acting like I was part of like the staff and shit. Like, you know, it was working. Nobody was pressing me on nothing. And then like I walked over to like one of the, like the lady in that was like on the stage who was a part of his band and like she was about to leave. And I was like, I said in my now, I was like, I was like, clearance island, clearance island. Yes, no Teddy, yes, no Teddy. And for like my American, viewers that means like you know i have clearance like where's teddy where's teddy and she was like he's right there and so like i went back inside and i looked back and teddy Alfred was literally chilling just sitting two feet away from me in the section and i was like i looked at him i said teddy please picture picture please please and then he was like he like he was tired as hell but he like smiled and he was like okay and he's such he's such a down-to-earth guy but teddy Alfred's the man i'm not gonna lie and like and I told him I was like I was like yeah yeah I'm Ted Degafi name and that means like you know I'm I'm his I'm your supporter or whatever. He was so cool with all of it and like his one of his like posse guys like whatever the guys that were with him they like took my phone and then they took the picture of us and I'm gonna show you it's right here bow and you know look at it it's it's, it's one goat and one future goat it's the but I, and then after this picture I shook his hand and I was like you gonna see me again and hopefully he does see me again you know hopefully this. This YouTube stuff takes off, you know, my community rallies behind me, become a comedian. Who knows what happens? You know, who knows what's in store for us? But it's a cool ass moment though. Saw the goat, took the painting picture with the goat. But anyways, that's my end of the story time. I appreciate you guys for watching the vlog. Thank you guys for the support that you always show me. It's amazing. I love it. Thank you guys so much. And you know, stay tuned. Peace out.